beautiful makeup lovers, bellezas, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am very excited because I am going to be reviewing the newest launch talent from Charlotte Tilbury. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe if you have not. If you are new to my channel, my name is Caroline. Welcome again. Please consider to subscribe. I upload videos every single week and I love luxury makeup. If you do too, then you are at the right place. And hit the notification bell so you don't miss any videos like this. Without further ado, let's get to it. For this new launch, Charlotte Tilbury released the airbrush bronzer that comes with a brush. I skipped the brush. I figured it was unnecessary for me since I have all the brushes, but it's absolutely beautiful. Nevertheless, I also picked the Desert Haze Luxury Palette that she released within this collection, absolutely beautiful. I will be sharing um, swatches on my arm and of course, um, applying it on my, on my face. I had my hair loose and wild just to get like a beachy look with a white top, but <laughs> Let me start with this video, ladies, and let me show you first the airbrush bronzer. This is the package signature look, beautiful mahogany with rose gold, and this is the package of the beautiful bronzer. I was really surprised with the size. I didn't know it was going to be this large. I know she said it was going to be bigger, but I didn't think it was gonna be this big. I do not own the Tom Ford or the um, Marc Jacobs in the large size. So this is my biggest and I really, really like it. It's beautiful, it comes in four shades, um, fair, medium, tan and deep. I picked up two, 10, which is this one and number three, and deep and number four. The reason why is because colors can be deceiving online and I didn't know if those colors either or was going to be either too light or too dark for me. This is number three, absolutely beautiful, it's not too, um, too reddish, too yellow, it's just beautiful. It's magnetized package, retails for $55. It is, let me check, I just don't want to get it wrong. 16 grams and 56 ounces of product in here, which leaves me thinking because this one combined is the same amount of product. And this is the Filmstar Bronze Glow. I just love it. I have it in the dark shade. This product is made in Italy and it has a shelf life of 24 months. Let me share with you now um, deep. This is how it looks. It's a little bit, I would say, cooler. The tone, it's more subtle. I will show you the swatches of both, but it feels very creamy and very pigmented, um, the formula on these bronzers. I don't know if I will be able to use deep right now, but I am going to try because I wanna show you side by side, both colors, so you can see in case you are deeper than me and the medium in case you are my shade or lighter than me, all of skin. Let me read a little bit of her website, which by the way, that's where I purchased my um, these cosmetics, I did it from her. Oh, one more thing, very important. This is also a refillable package for those of you who don't know. And right here, it's where you push the pen out and change it for the refillable. I think it's going to be available during the summer. Right now, I don't know when we're going to be able to finish this bronzer. But I guess that if you have only one bronzer and you're using this one on a daily basis, you, you finish it. But for somebody like me that have different bronzers, that's, I'm not going to finish it in this lifetime, I think. Um, let me read a little bit of information of her website. Charlotte Dubury says that this 
Bronzer was inspired by her famous airbrush flawless powder, which by the way, is one of my favorite powders. It's absolutely wonderful. Let me read a little bit on the description. It says that it, it is infused with hyaluronic acid for smoothing pore blurring effect. It's a matte bronzer for the face and the body. Her newer brush bronzer uses the same beauty finer brush DNA and fine as air finally meal pigments to blur the appearance of pores and smooth over your skin to make you look and feel like the best, most beautiful of yourself. Very promising. I guess that it's time now for us to test these beauties on my face. <laughs> Let's see if it's gonna really uh, reduce my pores and make me feel good. And I am ready to test these beauties on my face. I had to get my hair out of the way. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All of that hair, I can't work with the hair on my face. And let me show you a little bit. A lot of pigmentation. I already um, did my base. I use Everything Charlotte Tilbury. For my eyes, um, I'm not wearing any makeup, but it's prepped with NARS eyeshadow primer, a medium and dark. I applied a tiny bit because I hardly have any um, eyelashes of tight line and a little little bit of mascara all right let's test this beauty i oh, love it it's so creamy it blends so easily <gasps> love the color it's so pretty All right, and then she says that this is good for the body as well. This is a very natural coloring. It's the kind of that you can wear anytime. I think I applied a little bit too much down here. I have to say this is a very, very natural look. I love the color, very soft, very subtle, as you can see. I'm gonna get you a little bit closer so you are able to see the color better on my skin. There, you are able to see. Very nice. This is an everyday look. I don't think you can get carried away with this color. It's super, super natural. Really, really like it. Very, very nice. Now I'm gonna try color D. This one I wanna be a little bit more careful, but I was so right on getting both. Look. Yeah, it's a little bit deeper. I think it's great for when I get a little bit darker or if I want something more dramatic, a lot more for nighttime. But there's no patch, it's not patchy at all. Very, very nice. I'm gonna do a little bit under my jaw for a slimming effect. Right here. And as you can see, and this is color D. I hope you liked it. I really like it. The consistency of this powder is so beautiful. It really is finely milled. And I know it looks like um, a little bit intimidating and really, really dark, but even though it's pigmented, it goes very smoothly on the skin and it doesn't get patchy. I really like it. Very, very nice color. Now let's move to our um, luxury palette. And this is the color, absolutely beautiful. It retails for $53. 
and of course on the back I usually follow her guideline you have the guide with the um, number one all the steps that so you can do your makeup it makes it very easy that's why I prefer and love quads so much and with these colors they look so bright on the Instagram pictures but they're more um, nudes peachy brown and soft really is Charlotte Tilbury colors and we all like that natural look I'm gonna use um, to start this look this Wayne Goss in number six and I will use of course the lighter shade and I'm gonna use it as my highlighter and primer I know I mentioned already but I apply a medium nars eye primer in color medium dark and I really like it my eyes are hooded and most of the time my makeup gets gets a mess if I don't use a primer now using this color right here I'm gonna take this color right on my mobile eyelid and apply it going a little bit higher than my mobile eyelid now with Charlotte Tilbury's blending brush I'm gonna go into this shade of the palette right here and go on above my crease I'm gonna bring the color all the way here I love to have like this type of look of browns rose golds kind of so pretty peachy nudes and browns that's my thing and of course we all know pink then with Charlotte Tilbury smudger brush I'm gonna go into the darkest color And right on the outer corner, I'm going to apply this color like on the outer V. And we're gonna lift it for more lift effect. And bring that color on the bottom of my eyelashes. Then I'm gonna use the same blending brush from her and just blend that shade on the outer corner i'm gonna go back to the enhanced shade and just use it on my bottom lashes just to blend the darkest shades now we got a kind of hazy um look i'm not going to apply eyeliner i think this is more than enough for me i'm going to finish this eye apply mascara and be right back and I am back after I finish my eyes which I really haven't done it a hundred percent I'm gonna use this Charlotte Tilbury highlighter and this is the magic star highlighter this was a holiday release I never show it on my channel so many products so very little time that I'm going to use a refer brush this one in number 23 and use it right in the corner of my eyes for a little bit of light and make this look a little bit more sultry now that I completed the look of my eyes we're gonna move to lips and for that I'm going to use a combination of a lip liner lipstick and lip gloss on top from Charlotte Tilbury I'm gonna line my lips using Pillow, no, hot gossip lip liner. Just make sure there's no um, lip balm on my lips. I kind of overline my lips a little bit, very discreetly. Now, the lipstick we're going to wear is Karina's Star. This is like a orangey, peachy nude color. And I think it's gonna be perfect for this look. Then in the center of my lips to add more dimension, 
I will add um, also from the Red Hot Lips line, Angel Alessandra lipstick and right in the middle, apply this color. Then on the center of my lips, I will apply this lip gloss. This is a collagen lip gloss called Rosy Glow. We're going to apply this color right in the center of the lips, right here, with a brush. And on top of my cupid's bow, All right, now that we finish with my lips, we're going to have this beach look completed. And uh, this is it, makeup lovers. I hope you like the look I created with this beautiful new launch from Charlotte Tilbury. I am very pleased with my skin, with the product. This is absolutely a beautiful bronzer. And if you are, lighter than me this is gonna be perfect if you are my complexion i don't know if you want to go for a deeper shade or stay within this one or perhaps get both of them either way i love both of them i'm gonna keep them both they are very nice if you are a deeper skin you're going to really really be very satisfied very happy with a deep shade seeing how natural and how deep the color is. Um, I really, really love it. And I was observing my skin while I was finishing my eyes, the change, how my skin turned poreless and airbrush is really beautiful and a natural look. I love the kind of beachy and bronze look very, very much. I don't do this all the time, I, I'm not gonna lie, but I sure do love bronzer. I didn't wear it before, but now I have kind of become obsessed with bronzer and I love it. It can be more of a natural look if you go for the tan and more intense if you go for the deep color. For the eyeshadow palette, I think it's a beautiful eyeshadow, uh, very nice matte like the bronzer very natural they are pigmented creamy and very finely nailed powders in this eyeshadow palette as well as in the bronzer so i think it was a good addition to my collection that i'm going to be using with other um, charlotte tilbury eyeshadows as well as with others but this is a this is shadow palette is an everyday eyeshadow that you can use it for work it's a nice color story because, oops, I can't open it. It's a nice color story from light, medium to dark. There's no brain on this eyeshadow. You can use it very easily. Charlotte Tilbury tells you how to use it. Great compliment for other eyeshadows that might be in your, that you might have that they are only shimmers. This is perfect every day, all year round. Any skin color, just absolutely perfect. With this makeup lovers, we completed this video. I hope you liked this little collection. Let me know in the description box what are you getting or if you are skipping um, the eyeshadow and just getting the bronzers. Let me know. I love to hear your thoughts. I will leave everything linked down below for your convenience on the description box. As always, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it if you would like to see this channel grow and hit the notification bell to get notified for more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching Makeup Lovers and I will see you on my next video.